Well, well, well. Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one only, and welcome to Mon Research. <laughs> As you can see, I'm going to transition. This is actually uh, called P Pocket Error. And the reason for this is just because a lot of, um, this out of here, a lot of games, well, a lot of Pokemon games that don't really have the copyright, oh, no, dear God, loud. Let's just go through this. I already tried to record it once, but then there was no, like, um, background. So, yeah, this is a re-recording. Uh, I'm curious though. I want to see this. Okay then. But yeah, this is still the beginning. I didn't get like really far. I didn't even watch the um, cutscene. I just realized there was the, there was actually music in the background. Well, actually, when we started, there wasn't any music, was there? Huh. Interesting. Anywho. Let's get into it. Ugh, of course it's used. Oh god, that is... No. Get rid of the Y. There we go. Most of them turn out to be actually pretty good, like... Games. But 9 out of 10 of them end up being, um... Like, some of the wars a little bit. Well, not even a little bit. There was one that I used to play for a while. I don't know what the hell the name is under anymore. Unfortunately. I can't look at other things? Okay, fine. I'll just follow what you want me to do. Oh, I gotta throw it. Oh, that's a fun little summon. Oh, Charmander, okay. It's always fun playing like these Pokemon disguise games. From my point of view it is. Because I actually have like a lot of fun with them because they actually turn out to be unique. Okay, we're getting all the starters today apparently. Oh, never mind. We only get a taste of two of them. <laughs> okay, fine then. I definitely want to see the, the look of it. Ah, okay, so it is still like a summon of war. Do what you got. Oh, well. I'm trying to read skills. So, I'm wondering if there is a VIP system. Because most of these games try to feed off VIP, which I'm never a huge fan of VIP in any game. That's just me though. Ah, now we got the full roster. As a free to play, if I actually enjoy this game, I'm probably just going to go full on free to play, no VIP. And see how far I can make it in the game. If they have guilds, I'll make one too. I don't think I'm gonna be making like extra videos on it unless this series like gets really popular. Or unless this video gets like really popular. And you guys want that. That's normally how I base like most of my series now. The series I'm currently doing right now, like Pirates on line. Doesn't get a lot of people behind it, but I actually enjoy it more than anything. Just because it's literally my childhood. Okay, so we got runes in this one. 
That's weird because other ones I played definitely didn't have any runes for a rune system. They just had like um one of those upgrade systems where you get all the materials in different places and make them uh, different rarities. Yeah, they would normally have that. I want to put it part of the road. Alright, so... Oh, we can patch you. You know what, dude? Have you not learned not to get rid of magic carps With the whole Gyarados situation? But I'm pretty sure they had the whole upgrading system, too, to evolve them, right? It'd be weird if they didn't. I'm waiting for Pokemon to make like a whole new genre. Because I always like seeing new designs. Which don't happen too often. Right now they're just going off of like old Pokemon they have. I can't see what it does, thank you. Alright, so this does constant damage over time if you crit though. This oh, just does more damage with the number of allies that are dead. That's actually pretty nice. You want to s you definitely want to use him with, with weak people. Okay, never mind. You can actually probably solo with this, right? Just bring in like some weak characters, have them die, and just start one-shotting with this guy. And that could be an idea. Your tanks will no longer... Okay, so this is a passive. Your tanks will no longer... Technically miss. Like... This term just means you just do like half the damage you would do. Because you basically miss them, but you still hit them. It just does a lot of damage because it wasn't like a direct hit. If a lot of you guys were wondering that, I've always wondered that at first and see why I actually thought about it. <laughs> the inflicted damage of one attack won't exceed 35 of the max HP. Additionally, it attacks the attacker when you're attacked to inflict the damage. Okay, so basically a counter and a chance to stun. I should be looking at their skills too. Now what do you got? Damage is increased by each harmful effect on the opponent. Yeah, I like this weird large dialogue for the skills and have the actual main stuff at the bottom. <laughs> okay, decrease attack speed. Hits up to two enemies two times, I'll hit all enemies two times, and has a chance to inflict constant damage for three turns. Not bad. Alright, what do you have, Squirtle? Inflicts the damage is other enemies max HP. This attack receives a 30 percent crit rate. Huh. Decent, decent. Hits the target two times. Has a chance to decrease attack gauge. Interesting. Doesn't look like they have any really unique I was about to say animations off that, but then again, I was looking at Blaziken on that point. Oh, did you guys let me go? Am I free to do everything I want? What's in my mailbox? Nothing? Seriously? We don't get anything free? No free items? Which a ripper. So tomorrow you get an Arcanine. And the seventh day, you get a Pikachu. 
Interesting. Interesting. There are consecutive logins too. Get all those berries. Alright. Just making sure. If I wanted to, can I still... I'm not sure if I'm still allowed to um, link my account. I don't know where that would be if I was to keep playing. But that's unfortunate. I'll just restart if anything. <laughs> so you get a free great ball for downloading Facebook Messenger. Nah, I don't got time for that. I don't wanna. Wait, what the hell is this? Oh, this is paid stuff. Really? They went with the whole Battle Royale type ordeal? <laughs> wow, okay. Eh, that's weird. I'm all for people supporting games they love, but you never know how long games like this could stay up, though. That's for sure. It's kind of unfortunate that a lot of these Pokemon games are being targeted because some of them do like really unique things and and just like uh, it, it's hard to explain like they do like really unique things but then again I kind of feel like Game Freak should be more lenient but have a few guidelines behind it but then again there are some really insane greedy people out there who won't abide by that, which is kind of their own fault. Then that at that point they should be targeted. All right, so you evolve with this stuff, right? Okay. What's this? All fire types, huh? I mean, we may have been released, but it doesn't look like we're finished yet. Look at all those tutorials still there. <laughs> Alright, so we don't know what this does. Defense down. Multi-attack. Defense down and stunning. Whip him. Okay, so time speed is not locked. Auto is not locked. Because normally people would lock them to a certain level, which I would always hate. Pretty decent so far. So far. Oh god. The Flareons. The only thing I don't like is that there is no skip button for dialogues. No, stop it. It's always been like really interesting also to see what like random skills they would come up with for each character. And what random debuffs they would give too. Very rude of you. Gotta wonder if they were gonna follow the rules of the Pokemon or if they're gonna 
make their own thing, you know? Like, uh... What's the name? Belperion? Belperion? I think that's what the name was. But anywho, this Pokemon would normally absorb water. So water attacks wouldn't work on them. So would that be the same way or would it like be different? That's the real question. Doesn't seem like uh, it's different. <laughs> She does stun a lot though. So these Pokemons don't have like passives like the actual Pokemon game would have. Did you not? Oh, you can't click on the um, symbols here and see the effects, unfortunately. Okay, so that's immunity. Is there any other tutorials we need to go through? No, it doesn't seem like it. Why is this so up? Why is this still glowing? Did I miss something? Ah, okay, here it is. That's what you would click to bind your account. Ah, so you want me to use that. Okay, noted. I can get that back. I can just restart the game or something. Because I'm pretty sure you only lose your stuff if you, um... Oh, God. Pretty sure you only use your lose your stuff if you uninstall it. Summon thing. Not here. Oh, hold up. Guessing that's how people would battle me? Protect your defense team. Yeah, that's okay. There is PvP in there. But I can't wait to find some like more hidden like little Pokemon games and show them to you guys. Like there are actually a lot of your cool unique ones. Oh, so these are summoning rewards. Jeez. Do you get to choose between one of those? Oh, Swampert. Oh my god, the good old days of Swampert inside of a um, Sapphire and Ruby. <laughs> where Swampert would just literally become an unstoppable train with muddy water and surf. That Swampert was so broken. <laughs> I'm trying to remember where the summon was. This? Uh, this, right? Yeah, there it is. What you got? What you got? Oh god, he's green. See, that's something a lot of Pokemon games do too. Is that they have weird different Pokemons. Pokemon's not even of their own element. But here's the thing. I played another game that was quite weird to the point where if it was green, if the Pokemon was naturally green, they would count it as a grass type. Even though it had nothing to do as a grass type. It was basically like a psychic Pokemon or something like that, but it was green. So they were just like, oh, you know what? We're gonna make we're gonna make this a grass type. And I'm just sitting here like, uh no, I don't think that's how that works, sir. <laughs> but then again, huh? <laughs> 
can you really give them logic? But then again, it was under a Chinese game, and they were terrible at managing the game. I actually enjoyed playing in it, but it was also a VIP. And plus, there, there's a low chance of getting places, but I've gotten lucky with a few summons on that game. Pretty lucky. So that's why I kept playing it, just because at that point I was just like, well, I'm at a good standing, I might as well continue to play. Can you not do constant damage to me? I've learned in a lot of games, like, that crap hurts. Especially in a lot of, um... Oh, hold up. Especially in a lot of games that are, that are like, Summoner Wars. That constant damage, like, eats HP. Could you not shoot him? Yeah, single target would be better right now, huh? Hey, stop shielding, damn it. What the hell? And yeah, see, this is what I mean. Like, a they can do cool things like that, you know, make them into a different nature and change their design. That Arcanine looks really sick as water. So they have some original ideas that they've changed around with the Pokemons. Like, personally, me, I'd rather you make your own, but... Here's the thing, if you can change the design of a Pokemon, then why not just change the design, you know? You love the original Pokemons, it's true. Everybody loves the original Pokemons. But the thing is, you gotta change the design to, at least for it to be your own. But then again, hey, hey. To each its own, but you're taking a risk. Okay, that Arcanine looks nothing like... Oh my god, he looks sick though. <laughs> I was gonna say, that Arcanine looks nothing like the one in the picture, but he looks really sick. I love his look. Why does he look so cool? Not how he was advertised, but you know, it still looks cool. <laughs> Come on, get another attack down, thank you. Now skip your turn. Dude, your gauge goes up so fast. You not? You're not gonna kill the Charmander, okay? I'm gonna need you to stop. Get stunned. You guys already know we played a few of the um, other Pokemon games too, that are way more open about their game. <laughs> We finished a lot of quests there. I guess it's also because they're using their, using like original characters as well. I find it ha how funny other like little Pokemon games are out on Google Play, but they're not really being all that secret about it. They're just like, hey, dude, our game's available. Come play, dude. Oh, so we can get... Ah! Okay, neat. You have a chance of getting, um... Some Pokemon to drop, too. 
A few of the other Pokemon games that I've played does that too. Where is... Okay, I, I forgot it was Bag. What you got, Jigglypuff? You got a chance to stun, you got... Removes all harmful effects on one target. And heals, okay, now I have that. But you don't have any more skills from that. But you get a new skill. Oh, and you make them invincible. Oh! That's actually not half bad. This gets upgraded from... This to this. It has a chance to freeze. So obviously they get more and more skills. Hold up. What about this guy? What do you get if I was to evolve you? A new skill? So 100% chance to stun is what he'll get if he evolves. So I'm thinking this is one of the Hawaiian Pokemon from that gen. Um, I haven't really been keeping up with a lot of the Hawaiian Pokemon, but I believe this is one of them. But I, I see that you can still earn like uh, skills from like evolving. Uh, I'm not sure if it has to be like max level or anything. I think you just have to have the material then you can just straight up get to it. The question is, where is that point? I don't think they've introduced us into like a area for that yet. Normally we would get like a little daily dungeon we can enter. But I guess that's like further into the game. Oh god, Magikarps. You know what? Bring it, Magikarps. I want to see what you can do. I should have brought Jigglypuff. I'm going to bring her next one. But we're going to go through this one more time. Well, two more times, technically. I kind of like the coloring, though. Even though they technically, yeah, recolored everything. <laughs> but the one thing the game is doing is going off um, your elements of your Pokemon, not the element of your attack. So you gotta remember that. So if you're a hit of fire with a um, skull bash, you would still be dealing a lot less damage. Oh, I forgot about you. Shelly. Alright. Take you out, Bulbasaur, because you're just... Meh. You're alright. You're alright in my book, pal. Alright, let's... Oh, God, they're water. <laughs> just realized that. It's a good thing I brought you, Jigglypuff. Okay, so what element was this? Like... Dark and light. Of course, they don't have like all the other typings. Um, I've only seen one of these clone games do typings, but like I said, they didn't do the correct typings. They just counted it as a grass type just because it looked like it. I think I did it for um, who was it? It was that green snake thing. I can't remember his name. I think it started with Z, maybe? Maybe. But yeah, they did it for him. Just because he was green, they put him as a grass type. I'm not sure if that's actually correct, though. Not bad heals, though. He's dead. <laughs> Before he can even get his turn.
thank you. Oh, we got a prize. Now we get... Oh, I thought we had a prize, what the hell? Oh, the prize is buying this stuff. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> really? Well, I think it's this gym right here. It's probably the gym or the battle tree. Okay, yeah, I see the different places, the different islands. So three all here is the story quest. And the rest of this stuff is basically just normal um, daily dungeons and challenges that you can go through. Noted. Here's the arena. Gotta defeat the main Pokemon League? What? Oh, that's a guild. Stage 3, you gotta beat. Stage 9. Oh, you can actually see what you're gonna receive from it, too. Okay. Anywho, we're gonna end it there, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed trying it out yourself. Remember, the actual name is under, um... Oh. I was like, wait, what is this place? Can I move this? No? <laughs> but yeah, the actual name is under Mon Research. If you guys actually want to try it out and, you know, get into it. I'm not sure if, from what I've seen so far, I'm not sure if I'm going to actually keep playing. But I'll definitely look up some more of those. I'll actually go into Arena right now. But we're not going to do that. Hope you guys enjoyed. Incident. Out. Swear it's gonna get better real soon. Don't let anyone tell you what you should do. I got a clear view. We're gonna make it soon. Just keep pushing through. Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Just keep pushing through. Cause what you got to lose?